Greetings friends and fellow cigar box guitar enthusiasts. Del Puckett here and I just finished up this Black Beauty fretless slider. And I have the strings tuned E, B, E. These are the heavy strings. This is the 44, the 34, and the 26 wound. I do have a humbucker going through the potentiometer that is all properly grounded and I will show you kind of a nifty little trick on how I grounded this thing here and I do have a hole drilled right through here with the uh, string ferrule bushings here and that will be for the strap button this is an Arturo Fuente box. In fact, if you look really closely, you can still see the remnants of the Arturo Fuente logo. This has been sanded, primered, and painted black, and then glossed over so that I got a nice shiny gloss. This is an, a maple neck. You can actually see the grain in the maple there. And a maple fretboard that has been dark stained, sanded and dark stained and steel wooled and then also glossed. So, I will string this thing up, or not string it up, I will intonate it, and then I'll set the position markers up here according to the harmonics. This is number 317. Check out this nifty idea on how to ground your bridge. So I determined where the, the string catch was going to go. And then I got a little ground wire with one of these little loops on the end. And then using the Dremel, I just carved out a little trench. That was the perfect height so that this guy would be recessed just enough to go underneath the hinge and then get properly grounded. Ha uh ha. -huh. You can't even really tell because it's lower than this piece of wood here. So entirely concealed. So now it's time to string it up. I've got the strings on and stretched. And then what I did was using my harmonics, I found the double dot and then also the 7th fret harmonic and the 5th fret harmonic. And I also found the notes using the slide for above the octave. Now you ask, why didn't I put any down here? And the reason being is because there is a plethora. Do you know what a plethora is? A plethora is many. Listen to how, how many harmonics are down here. So what I like to do is use all sorts of those. So what I do typically is I do a divide by. So in my mind, I see this marker here and I see the nut here. And in my mind, I divide by two and I get the exact halfway point, And that's the note that I use for this guy. So instead of me putting a marker there, I just divide by this gap right here and just target that, that spot. I don't know if that makes sense or not, but that's the secret note. Okay, so I did want to plug this thing in to the Vox Mini, and here's the settings, and I'm gonna dial up a delicious beat
cool little lamp. That was a PVC adapter. The next one is a spark plug. These things are heavy. If you're not careful, you can break your finger. copper adapter you don't want to use the paper side I use the smooth side <laughs> How about the boner? Then the medicine glass bottle. This thing's got a tap tempo. So I can make it faster. It's like a double. And you can actually play like a fretless. Now I'm not very good at this, but way over my head. Hope you enjoyed the video. Hope you enjoyed the build. Be sure to like, comment, subscribe, share, and I will see you in the next video.